Hi, this is Brandon at Android Device and Tutorials. Here we're going to do a quick kind of review, overview, how to use the uh, photo editor on the Google Nexus 5. This is the KitKat editor. It just so happens that the Nexus 5 is the only one with it right now. Um, so here, basically, we just took a picture of the car outside. Um, and you can get to it however you want, any image you want. You tap it, and you'll see an editor or an edit button down bottom, kind of a pencil. So when you tap that, you'll get all of the editing features. Okay. Now here down bottom, what you're going to see is first is a filter browser, then borders, cropping, uh, mirroring, rotation, things like that, um, and um, kind of color, like uh, exposure, things like that. Um, so here you see these. Let's go ahead and we'll just run through them. There's um, borders, crop, straighten, rotate, mirror. And then auto color, exposure, contrast, shadows, things like that. Um, so here, why don't we go ahead and we'll start editing this image. This is what it looks like originally. So we'll go ahead into crop because we um, don't want all this driveway and don't necessarily need all the trees. We just want the car. So we do that. Go ahead and say OK. So there's the car. So now we go and we say, OK, we want to kind of change the way this thing looks. We want to do the... Um, Let's look through. That adds pretty good lighting. But let's do vintage. We want to make it completely different. Okay, so we leave, we do vintage. And then we go in and we say, okay, we want the rounded kind of rough borders. Let's see. There, in the interest of this video, let's do that crazy white border. Um, Okay, so that's it. So now here we can undo if we want, undo different changes, or we can save it. So let's go ahead and save it. Okay, so you see it's very easy to make changes to a photo. Uh, let's close it all out completely, as if we or were completely out. There's no, no apps open, nothing there. Okay, now one of the greatest features of this is the fact that we can go back to the gallery, back to the image. And you see there's only two images here. So our original image for all intents and purposes, looks like it's completely gone. So now we're here. So what we'll do is we'll go back into the editor. And you see the image there. We can tap our menu up here. Show applied effects. And then here you can see the effects that were added to the thing. The different crops and things like that. Okay. So <clears throat> we see that we've made a few different changes. We can tap this again and we can actually reset and you see what that does is it takes it back to the original image even though you saved the image and exited out completely it was still there you're able to revert completely back um, which is nice because sometimes you change an image and you wish you had the original back you know whatever you could have also used the feature there was another one in that menu called export that would have exported a copy that way you had both images um, but that's pretty much the photo editor for KitKat um, and of course we went through it on the uh, Nexus 5 here. So if you have any questions just leave them in the comments or visit us at AndroidAdvice.com. Um, otherwise, thanks for watching.